Here's a video from the CBC. India Supreme Court declines to legalize same-sex marriage. Hopeful, then heartbroken, then really heartbroken. Her hope soured as the judgment was read out. India's highest court was rejecting gay marriage, even as the judges expressed sympathy and a willingness to bolster LGBTQ rights. As a Canadian, I remember when the LGBT were saying, we just want the right to get married, that's all. And then it turned into, oh, well, we want to teach same-sex education in schools. And then they merged with the trans community, and then the trans community wanted to use, you know, women's bathrooms and such. It's the whole give an inch, take a mile. So India saying no to same-sex marriage? Good on them. But the fact that they were sympathetic tells me that sooner or later, they're going to change their ruling. And these LGBT people, they're just going to keep at it. And sooner or later, the judges are just going to go, you know what, just let them have it. And a willingness to bolster LGBTQ rights. Heading into this fight, longtime couple Abe Dang and Supriyo Chakraborty just wanted their wedding to be more than symbolic. In this day and age, that's what weddings are. They're just symbolic. Long and now you, you've won nothing. You're, you're back to like where you were. The five-judge bench disagreed on whether to extend adoption rights to same-sex couples. So they're waving on whether or not to give adoption rights to same-sex couples. Yeah, reminds me of that monkeypox stuff. I always wondered how kids would catch it, but anyway. On this aspect, so leaving it to, to the parliament, uh, you know, we, it, it'll be a long wait. Especially since the Indian government argued those demanding marriage equality were just urban elites. Yeah, I could see that. Urban elites. Nothing better to do with their time. Also, I'm looking at this pride parade. Look how clothed they are. Compare that to the West before it became all degenerate. Can't allow the same-sex marriage being India, an ancient country, ancient culture. Fighting that thinking is still the plan for many here. It's not an overnight thing. We need to come back. We need to fight for our equal rights. If I was one of these judges, here's what I would have said. Look, we see what's happening in the West, and we don't want this in India. It'll destroy our country and our culture. You Westerners gave them what they wanted, and then they turned around and wanted more. So yeah, I saw this video, and it reminded me of Western LGBT. All, all we want is the right to get married. Well, anyway, take care out there in clown world.